Alrighty guys, so welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero, where today I do got a bit of a plan already made up. So, uh, last episode we actually really did not even go far from where we are. Also on that little interactive map that I found for uh, the Below Zero map, I have found exactly where I am. And I didn't go anywhere near a Reaper, so yesterday I was just sketching out. Um, but yeah, anyway, today the plan is to go and get us, uh, was it a sea glide there first. Now, I did already, uh, go around and scan everything I need, and I did do a tiny bit of resource collecting when I went out and got some food. But, wasn't too much else done there. And, again, uh, if you're wondering where all, the, like, the sea moth fragments are, they're legit just everywhere around the base here. Once I get me some lubricant here, or... Oh, there's a supply cache nearby. Ooh, that might be something we have to check out later. But we need creep vine, because I need to make lubricant. Okay, so we're back in the base. I got me my lubricant. We're just going to make as much of this as we can, because we will need it. Okay, that is all the lubricant. I need a chunk of titanium, right? Yep, and then we could now make a sea moth. Or not sea moth, sea glide. I don't even actually think the sea moth is in this version. We get something called the was it the sea truck instead, or do we get access to a sea moth? A personal transportation device used for high speed free diving. Contains a built-in light and map. You know what I should also do, just because I do have the stuff for it, and I did, and I have ran out of it. I need storage, and I watched somebody do this once. So please work, because I tried this back in the original. Subnautica series, and also that peeper that just swam by the window scared me. <laughs> I thought there was something outside. Oh, they've patched it. You can no longer drop these in here. Oh, well. It's not like I won't be able to find the storage. And luckily, it stays right there, and now I can drop all this excess stuff I don't need right now in there. And anything I need on my hotbar right now? Yep, the knife. I hit escape on accident. Back to game, please. So, I think now what we're going to do that we got the, was it, oh, we'll unpin it now that we got the sea glide, is we're going to actually go check out this Altera emergency catch. It's not far, not far at all. Um, dang, there we go. Also, another thing that we are looking forward to is a repair tool. I don't think we technically need it yet, but just thought it might be something that we should try and get at some point. Um... So this is to the west. I think I know where this supply catch is because I think I see it on my map. Because again, I do got that little web map pulled up. Um, can I toggle this map? Yes, I can. Oh my god, it is dark. Okay. Get up on the ice. How do I get there? Do I? Oh, no. I don't know if I want to do this. Because, oh, no, it's right there. And look, we got oxygen right up there. Okay, I'm just sketching out because I thought I was going to have to go under the ice. Anything good here? A health pack. There's probably a bunch of stuff here I can scan. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. Well, I can't shake the feeling this planet is cursed. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. Not what I wanted to do. Not what I wanted to do. <sighs> Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave. Not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, it's down here. Something ain't right. Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. Ooh, we got an oxygen bubble. But I might know how to. Whatever you're thinking, we never had this conversation. Use beacons to mark traverse territory. Show or hide the signals of your choice with your Xenoworks PDA. 
Now with surface support. Mobile vehicle bay fragment. Nice. I need one more of those. Ooh. We got lucky. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh, if I could just get an oxygen plant. I hear crash fish and I need sulfur from one of them. Okay. I'm pushing my luck. Please, please. Oxygen. Oxygen. Is this a starfish? New creature discovered. Spinfish. <laughs> nice. Okay, let's. I got gold. What's on this one? Silver. Oh, I got more oxygen down here. I'm really should probably keep moving and try and find a way out because now I'm kind of lost. Honestly, best way out is probably up. Hey, buddy. You want to pop out of there so I can. Uh, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Boom, let's go up. Leave me alone, crash fish. What is this? Are you what? A whole oxygen. fish. Ooh. What was that? What was that? Something just took a bite at me. I Oh, it's a sea monkey. I feel like the sea monkey took a swipe at me. Also, uh, the sea glide makes it so much easier to grab fish. Because you quite literally are faster than them. I just grabbed like five... Uh, ladder fish here. What is this? Is there a thunderstorm? Yeah. And okay, so now we have everything that we need for the repair tool. I really don't think I need to make one just quite yet, but I still am. Just, you know, to get it out of the way. Boom, repair tool. Um, tch -tch -tch. Do I want to cook the spin fish or is he going to be my little buddy? You know what? He can be my little buddy. I'll keep him in my inventory. I need to make a bunch of water, though. Um, also, I think the plan has now changed to let's get a vehicle. Mobile vehicle bay. So, t -t -t -t. boom. Okay. I'm pretty sure we might be able to do that. Oh, yeah. No, we could absolutely do that. We could absolutely do that. Okay, I need, was it five titanium? One, two, three, four, five. And I have a piece of gold, surprisingly. Um, coral, coral, coral. Two. Is it this stuff? Can I just hit it? No, damn. I might actually have to go find coral. Unless it's, like, something else that's nearby. Um, do you count? No, you're mushroom. Can I eat you, though? Oh, I can. That's interesting. Um, I'm wondering what... Does this count as the coral? No. Yeah, that's interesting, because now I don't know where to go to get that. Huh. I think I definitely had a jump in what I'm supposed to do. But I kind of want to get the mobile vehicle bay done today and then tomorrow. I kind of want to focus in on going to that outpost that it told me about. Anything in here? Uh, Alright, I'm going to try and find right, some coral. I got stuck under the ice! I just tried strimming straight up and got confused on why I couldn't go up anymore. There was ice in the way. Oh, that was great. Also, we got one of these. Again, uh, the sea moth fragments are quite literally just everywhere around your uh, little hut there. So it's definitely worth trying to get. Um, 
Okay, last time I went out this way, I kind of got spooked. And I think that was just my mind getting to me. Ooh, what are you? Did you just... F oh! Ow! What happened to me? What did they do to me? I can't move. I'm drowning. I'm drowning. I'm gonna drown. Oh my god, no. Okay, I'm unthawed. Okay, uh, you guys ain't nice fish. I wasn't even drowning there, and I just started panicking that I was gonna drown. Okay. Okay, so I just dove down pretty deep here. What is that? I just dove down pretty deep in the... Okay, this is where we get the table coral. But we're over there, and was it the... The bridges area? The windy bridges? And it appears that... We got one piece of coral from down here. There's gotta be another one somewhere. Although we're starting to get some exotic life forms. Um, what is that? That sounds like a distress call. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. So 200 meters down, we just got a distress call. Also, I'm pretty sure that thing just took a swing at me. You're not table coral. Where did I swear I just saw one. There. Okay. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Up, 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 up. There we go. I knew this would come in handy. But we got our table coral. And we also got a distress call from something. I mean... I was, like, wondering what that beeping sound was. I'm like... Should I, like, acknowledge it, or am I just going crazy? <laughs> and then she was like, what is that? What sounds like a okay, call. got a personal log. Who or what is out here calling for help? Didn't sound human. Maybe it's from a remnant of architect technology. In her message, Sam's colleague did say there was something important here. Even if it's just a mimic from one of the more intelligent aquatic specimens, that could be a major find. Or if it's from Altera, it could have bearing on what happened to Sam. I should definitely check it out. Okay, so it's just me talking about having to go find that. I think I've already listened to those two. I, if not, I might come back later and listen to them. But I'm pretty sure we should be fine. So let's get the titanium alloy made. Or the titanium ingot. And then need that to make the computer chip and then we got the computer chip and I'm pretty sure I got a thing of lubricant over in here or if not it's outside in this storage container please be in this storage container yes okay now we got a vehicle bay now I really don't think that was this is something that we should have probably focused on today but I'm still glad that we did because that means if we do, was it, I think if anything, we're able to construct the sea truck. If not, I mean, we got this at least. So let's go out here. It's hailing right now. Okay, one and boom. Okay, and you can get re -hot barred. Okay, can I climb on? Yep. Yeah. Can I craft anything? No recipes are available. Well, that is just perfect. So I guess I made that for no reason at all today. Huh. Well, at least we got the distress signal here. We'll hop in here so that way when I look through all this stuff, I don't drown. Also, I can drink some water, eat some nutrient bars. Um. Yeah, it's quite literally just random noise. Huh. I got power cells now. Do I really? Okay. We need to look for a sea truck. 
but I think more importantly is probably going after here if I go to uh, where is it where was that log there was one that we got earlier that was telling me that I need a head somewhere where there's an antenna yeah, this one here. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Um. I wonder where that radio tower is. Or what was it called? Was it Outpost Zero? Because that's like the closest one besides, uh, was it? We got a floating dock nearby. Altera platform. I might go look at that because, well, we did just go over there into the deep part of the twisting bridges, and I'm pretty sure I just shot past a bunch of that stuff on the way back. Yeah, because there's even PDA data pads out there about that. So either tomorrow we'll head up to the north here to outpost zero i think that's the one it wants me to head to if not we'll head down to the well we'll head up north to outpost zero we'll head down south to where it looks like i'll be able to get the sea truck here on the map but yeah anyways if you guys have found yourself at any point today enjoying the episode please do remember to leave a like and subscribe also, remember to ring that notification bell so that way you guys can be notified upon me posting any new videos. And yeah, this has been Gunshy More. Peace out. <laughs>